Hi, welcome to another Tarot and Oracle Review. Today I'm presenting to you a wonderful pack of unicorns by Palo. I'm not going to pronounce his last name, um, but he's absolutely Italian, fabulous guy. So the text is by um, somebody else, his, who they Paula, who've um, translated this pack. So as you can see, the box um, is quite sturdy, nice box, translated in a few languages on the back. So when you open the box, you do have this beautiful ribbon that allows you to lift up the cards on the book. Pretty simple. <laughs> so here we have the great little book. Um, it's translated in all in languages and the English, if you're speaking English today, is just this thick, um, just describing each one of the cards, 34 cards. Now in the front, um, it doesn't have many spreads, it just tells you about you can do one, two or three card reading, but of course you can do anything you like, it's your pack. So there's no um, pictures in the book, it's just uh, text. But what is new about this book is that it gives you four options to each card. So those options are the story, the, um, the meditation, the affirmation and the action. So transformation, meditation, affirmation and action that you need to do from each one of the cards. So, the cars are that high, <laughs> and there's a very, very good stock from that Italian company, La Scalabo. So, there you go. And on the back is a lovely design. Two unicorns. I think that's lovely. <laughs> right, okay, so if you've seen my review on the cats, uh, they're very much in the same vein. Um, how some of them are grey. So let's run through them. Uh, they're not in order. <laughs> um, it doesn't surprise me at all, really. Uh, but that doesn't matter. So let's start off with the first one. Um, some of them are grey, but some of them are colourful. So he always does this kind of thing um, in his packs. You'll probably notice it. So don't be put off by not a, it's not a and it's something else. So it allows you to use your imagination and more expand your mindset instead of being so fixed. So when it says not a street lamp, it's not a street lamp, <laughs> but it is clarity. Okay, so this is the kind of um, palette that he uses in some of his cards um, in each one of his packs. <clears throat> so you can see that's um, not a street lamp. And this is not a clock, but it's time. So don't be put off now. We do have colour cards. Okay. So it's not a peacock, it's beauty. <laughs> so that is beautiful, isn't it? So you can see this is um, Palo's really fantasy, really kind of unique art. This unicorn is on the front of the box. Not a dragon, but purity. So this is the dragon on the box. Really beautiful transformation. His art is just incredible. Not a flame, but creativity. I'm sure we've all looked at naked flames um, and seen different shapes and whatnot. I think it's probably um, a rare occurrence that if you have got an open fire. Not a snowman, but mystery. And there's your snow unicorn. <laughs> a snow unicorn there. Beautiful. Not a tree roots it's clever isn't it what we see and what it is is entirely different and this is in the book um, not an angel 
but divinity. <laughs> Not an owl, it's wisdom. Not an horse, but direction. I don't know why there's that an there. I think most people drop the H, don't they? Horse. <laughs> Not a seahorse, but perspective. English is a funny language, isn't it? Um, as I say, it does do the other languages in here. Uh, Russian, Spanish, French etc. Not a sensual, a fighting spirit. Harmony. Not a raven, but an omen. Not a demon desire. Not a flower, but vulnerability. Oh, this is so sweet. Look, 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 look. Oh. So delicate, the flowers, aren't they? Not a cat, but hunting. <laughs> Not a planet, but space. It's a nice planet, isn't it? We all want to live on a unicorn planet. Choice. You'll love this color. Intensity. Quite how they've done the origami swans, isn't it? Clever that. Not a boat, but a journey. I love these notta. I think it's so clever to do that. Just expand your mind a little bit. What we think something is, is actually not. Not a constellation, but hope. Not a butterfly, but metaphorsis. Transformation. Oh. Not a fairy, but magic. <laughs> so I'm hoping you're liking these cards. And this is his famous leaf dancing. He does these lovely leaves. If you see my cat review by the same um, artist Palo, then you'll know the leaf one. Not a snail, but calm. That's nice, isn't it? Calmness. And mountain, nope, stability. Not a cloud, but fluidity. Not a mermaid. Daring. A daring mermaid. A mischievous mermaid. Mm -hmm. Not a yeti, but strangeness. Oh, look at the baby yetis. <laughs> How sweet are they? Mm. Not a stone, but simplicity. Not a hairstyle, but pride. Not a race, but rush. Everyone's too busy. Everyone. 
And the last card of the whole deck, not a tiger, but majesty. Majesty. So I want it to be good to have um, a unicorn shaped like a tiger. So as you can see, these are quite interesting cards, aren't they? Um, different uh, unicorns, including planets, clouds, trees, all sorts of things. Anything can be a unicorn. Expand your mind. Thank you for looking at this review and we'll see you in the next one. Do take care and have a good unicorn day.